I'm not entirely sure what the plan is for today. James said that he wanted to clean up this area because it's pretty dirty, it's pretty unorganized. Crap is everywhere. Um, Ruth and I needed to get out of the house for a minute, so we came up to see what's going on. Um, but last week we left off, I guess it was Saturday, we left off on joining um, the beams with some cross beams for support for the um, trusses. And yeah, we have to get all this area cleaned up before we can bring a boom lift out here to put the trusses on um, because the boom lift, well, we'll have to go everywhere <laughs> and there's nowhere for it to go. Sounds like he's clearing up, so I am going to go and see where I can help. Hey, baby girls, what's up? You hear daddy? has been a really cold few days out here. Now mind you, Texas really only gets, you know, like maybe two to three weeks of actual winter temperatures. But this fall we had a really cold snap. And by really cold, I mean like in the 40s. We've had some really cold nights, but it's been really rainy, really wet, obviously. We haven't been able to do any work on the house because it started raining, dried up, then it got cold and started raining again. And now the kids are home from school because basically all of Texas has <laughs> closed the grade schools. I came outside because it's just a little cramped in our trailer. Uh, there's five of us all basically in the same room and I have to work. So I needed some space, I needed some fresh air. So I thought I'd come and look at the house and you know, daydream a little bit, so. Anyway, it's nice to be up here. It is so peaceful. It's always really nice up here with the bird song. That's probably one of my favorite things about this place is all the bird song, especially in the winter time. Um, there's just a different kind of song. It's really peaceful and really lovely. And it won me over actually. We saw, so three years ago, we came out and saw this property. Um, it was February of 2020 and tromping through it and we found some dead cows <laughs> that was interesting but uh, I just remember how wild it was how beautiful it was and um, had a creek on it it was everything that I could have asked for and I absolutely love it out here So what James is working on today is uh, these, what are they called, hurricane straps? Hurricane ties? Anyway, they're gonna hold the trusses. Um, they are spaced, how far apart are they spaced? 24 inches um, on center, or does it matter, does it? 
Anyways, so they're spaced about 24 inches apart and then the trusses will rest in there. And right now he's just putting them on the exterior uh, walls, or I guess the, the north and south walls of the house. How you doing, Moo Bear? Dante. Can I pet your belly? Hey. Hi, honey. Ow. Hey. How are you? Can I pet your belly? Can I put your bellies? Thank you. Well, it is super bright today, but it's beautiful. The sun is shining, obviously. And um, it's a really lovely breeze. James is working on the interior of the house again. I don't think you can see him. Videoing you? Huh? Videoing you! Okay. Why? What? what? Do you have any more needles? Then your butt? Nope. Can you hook up there? It's like every time I turned around, you went someplace else. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> That's fine. I just... I'm just a creeper wife. What am I. Sorry. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> There he is messing with the mud. <laughs> How? You okay?
Oh. That really shakes the ground, don't it? Somehow, this first one I put down just did not. Hey bud, how you feeling?
Nice stool. Talking about my butt? <laughs>